do, 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 do. Huh? Oh, hey, four. How's it going? How's your day? Uh, actually, excellent timing. I was just on my way to your farmhouse. Really? In the rain? Sure, why not? You see, I reached a comfort. You see, you see, I reached a comfortable break point in my research today, and um, and um, I thought it might ask you to join me for dinner. Sure, we could do another day. It didn't. It did. It did that. It didn't coincidence. We could, of course, do it some other time. Well, I could say no for that. So yeah. Anyway, shall we get going then? Sure. Oh, we would not catch a cold, so yeah. Sorry, I had to move the camera because I can't go through. Anyway, back to the story. Somebody bit me! I never thought I would to see the day for brought a date with him to the dinner. Oh, hang on. I think the tear is coming in. Oh, Brad. Why? But, but I had no wonder why those two lovebirds would spend their rare night out together in a kind of place. But I would think that most couples would want to do something more like candlelight dinner. Uh... That's never gonna happen. Sorry. Well, excuse me for only running, for running in the kind of place. But she just wanna hear to see you, so. Oh boy, boy's mad. That's enough, you two. It's gonna stop trying to ruin our date and leave us in peace. Oh. You tell him, Ford. You tell him. Okay, okay. We'll be good and stay quiet. Yep. Yep. Us in the third wheel. We'll just mousing over that way and keep to ourselves. But before we take off, I gotta ask you one thing. Oh, boy. If you must. Tell me, Ford. What about? What it is about Ashley that made you fall in love with her? Oh, that never know. Ooh, I've been really curious about this, that myself too. I've been dying to, to know. You shouldn't know, Ford. Just don't answer. I don't know. Exactly. Just act cool. Um, there had to be something, right? Like Ashley's smile or common interest to you two to share, you know, like that? Brad! Will you stop padding? Will you stop padding on and on? I don't know, alright? Like... Uh, Brad, I'm getting a feeling you've done stop stepping a snap. Into a cow and pie this time. Oh, you tell it, Marlin. Hey, uh. Sorry, Ashley. It's fine, Brad. It's fine. I forgive you. Well, I just run. Oh, no. I make him worry really fast. Don't run that fast, Ford. Don't. Ashley, wait. Ford! I tell you not to run. Oh well, you'll get tired eventually. So, uh, maybe we shouldn't have done it that, huh? Yeah, I think fourth launch tomorrow is gonna have to be on the house. Wow, Brad. Wow. <sighs> Ashley, there you are. Oh. Hey, four. Sorry! Uh, uh, I've been looking all over for you, and I wasn't expecting you run off like that. Because I just did. Or... Well, no. I think I guess why you left. First, there's something you must understand. What I said in the restaurant was the truth. Oh. 
However, I imagine that I might have expressed in the way that I have lead to an impression when I meant. I would like the chance to explain myself, but might I stand next to you? Sure. Sure. Take a look. Pretty nice. What a lovely view. You can say that again. Hen. Hen. You know, I like... Hen. You know, I think the last time I, I took the time to stop and enjoy the scenery, it's like it was back when I was a teenager. Wow. Long time ago. Actually, my whole life was have always knowing as meant to be a doctor. Whoa. Tell me more. I've been pounding all my time and energy into my study and cheated that it was a little far removed from romance or fi or flight of fantasy. I haven't been I haven't been loved before, but I haven't little experience to draw upon. Yikes. That's harsh. I feel bad. When I finally compared my feeling for you, I was confused. You were confused. Why was that? I only found myself looking at you. What did it make you different from anyone else? Because I'm different. Because I'm cute. What else? I haven't spent much time pounding those very things, but I haven't yet find an answer. But it's yet the truth that without realize it, I only found turn my gaze at you. Because <laughs> I'm cute. <laughs> but I cannot articulate particular why. I just do. I don't have... No way to answer that question. Exactly. That is why I said, I don't know. Oh. What about you, Ashley? What about me? What is it about me that is attracted to you? Do you know? Your kindness? Your... That is your weirdo. You looked. Well, according to the calculations, in my opinion, that is your weirdo. Don't ask! It said on the website, and the game no. So I don't even know. So I see. You share your... You share with... In anyone else's opinion, and that I regret? Yep. Is there a problem with it? Well, there is no reason to deny that I am. I have no longer been calling that by that... By anyone around me. It just doesn't bother me anymore. Well, good. Don't worry, my feeling for you will not overweigh over something that is coincidental. Okay. Oh. What? My audit my own identity is my greatest value? I'm not sure I follow. Well I will follow. Oh, because I think of things that I do not even accord it to everyone? Yeah. Heh, you're the only one who would ever look at it that way. Perhaps this is what I draw me to you. He, <laughs> Cute. Ooh. Actually, I have a little found it for those no self-dependent or self motivated It not if and and but about it. Okay. That's a lot I can say. According, most people tend to keep me at fresh respectful distance true and all of them at one point and another had told me that i am too hard on others that i learned to be kinder well you are kind just the way you are and special the way you are so yeah all of them except you exactly to trust me though i have thought the fact except both of myself and those around me why i didn't why i didn't you Okay, let me read it again. I thought it was fact except by both myself and those around me. Why did you ex agree to do it? I wonder. Because I'm cute. I wonder I pounded that thought. I pounded it and I pounded it until one day I can it came to me. Because I originally must be curious about why everything you do. <laughs> because I'm in love with you. <laughs> You're so cute. So science. And that is if I answered as what draw me to you. That's a good answer. But I accept it. He's so cute. I'm glad to see what this mis Mr. Misunderstanding has been resolved then. 
It's getting quite dark out, so let's head back home for tonight. Okay, Ford. Up. Uh, okay, I'll just help you out. How do you know my needs were about to give out? Because you just run, Ford. I am sorry. I do not try to get an opportunity amount of, of exercise every day. Because you did that for a reason. But I never imagined that I would need to run full speed ahead in the mount up the mountain, mountainside at the, at my rate. I can't breathe. Let's see it. We're trying again. But I never imagined. I never imagined that I wonder need to run full speed ahead up a mountainside at my age because you just do it. You know, it's my personal policy of mine to never rush anywhere like a fool and woke up a sled. That's how I feel. But whenever you involve, it's in all of that goes right out the window. True. 